When it comes to painting any fish, whether it's a bluegill, a largemouth bass, or, or any fish that you could possibly imagine, from Washington State to Florida, from California to New England, everybody has the opportunity to have a bluegill or to, to study a bluegill at some point. Now we're just going to lightly apply the green. We're staying above the lateral line. And as you notice, I'm not going left to right. I'm just kind of hovering so I can watch that color go on there very carefully. That way I can control the different tone values as I put it on there. You want to make sure that when you, you cover color or you go over the same application of color again that you're, you're mindful that you're going to darken it. So the top of the back can be fairly dark, but we want to make sure that, uh, that we're controlling exactly where that green's going to go. Keep your distance and allow the candy cranes gray to build. This, uh, this black blue Payne's gray is a really wonderful color to put the signature on the fish. Be very you can use some gold or some yellows in some cases. Again, it just really all depends on your, on your uh, reference material that you're using. Now this is the real fine-tuned detail work that you really want to demonstrate in your painting ability, and especially if you're going to be competing it's these little signatures that I want to see as a judge that tells me that you understand the essence of this particular fish. Using the duo blue-green here. Yeah, I'm using the candy bright yellow on the pelvic fins. The pelvic fins have a much more unique color than the pectoral fins. And basically what I'm trying to do here is, is I'm just spraying that yellow, trying to hit the hard rays. I'm going to leave my, my tip or my edge somewhat clear. Uh, a yellow green looking pastel color. And again, if I want certain scales to pop in this area, I'm just going to put on a lighter color. I want to thank you for spending your time and your money to buy the Angler's Artistry Master Education DVD series of Painting the Bluegill. 